My name is Meshak Depta, an agronomist working with Dream Team Agro Consultants Limited. Currently, we are upscaling IPM packages under the current and emerging threats to crops innovation lab, which is funded by the USAID. And these IPM packages we are doing all over Kenya, whereby we have identified and selected a thousand treatment fields and a thousand control fields in various counties in Kenya. For my case in Busia County, we have 100 treatment fields. We have trained farmers on the IPM packages. We, distribu we distributed any post to the farmers, like the seeds, biochar, and organic planting fertilizers. Farmers planted on their various treatment fields. For those fields that they have got or had the trigger weed, we supplied the cherry kill and then they used it for planting. After planting, we did field checkups to check whether the crops that have been planted they were affected by the fall armyworm. And for those that they were affected, we supplied the parasites to control the fall armyworm. In addition, we do data collection and then submit with the plant village researchers to check the general condition of the crops. And alongside that, we do carry out the surveys and scouting using the Plant Village Nur app, which is then submitted to the AG Observatory of Plant Village Nur, whereby it can be accessed by the various researchers across the globe. Today, I have visited Farmer John Okia in Busia County, Samia Sub County, Bumenya Village, who is one of the farmers carrying out this project and I've come to check on the progress of his treatment field whereby for real the maize are doing well, growing vigorously and there's no infestation by the fall armyworm and the trigger waves. The farmer applied the IPM packages like the chow kill for trigger weed, the parasites for the fall armyworm and intercrop with the beans so as to increase the soil fertility and not forgetting biochar which is a soil amenda. After looking at the status of the treatment field, I am now going to show you in comparison the status of the control field. This is the control field that belongs to a nipper farmer and it has been invested by the fall armyworm and as you look at the maize plants if you look in at the leaves you can see that they have been pinholed and this shows that the investation is high and the yield is going to be low and therefore now this is an indication that in the fields whereby the IPM packages have been not applied, the investigation is high and the product or the produce are expected to be low. After looking at the control fields and the treatment fields, we can confidently say or qualify that at the treatment fields, the crops are doing well and the yields are expected to be higher. And this is because of use of the IPM packages like the parasites for fall amyworm, use of kichawi kill for stringer weed, use of resistant maize seeds for MLND, use of bio pesticides, use of intercrops like beans and desmodium, which improves soil fertility, and finally the use of biochar which is soil amenda is compared to the control fields which no IPM packages were applied. Mm -hmm.